Welcome back to Blue and Star Defense 6. Today, I think I found an exploit kind of against the Vortex. This is not the Elite Vortex, but I did beat the Elite Vortex using the strategy. Um, I did get a Pew Pew Boy, which is a sniper. Uh, I'm gonna upgrade it to semi automatic. I don't think I'm killing it fast enough. I need, yeah, you need that, and I'm just gonna put the uh, attack shooter right down there, just for an example. Or not, or not, or we could just die. That would also work. I'll be fine. Everything's fine. This is hard. Demonstration. Okay, this is a demonstration. So for demonstration purposes, there's the elite defender, and my tower's got stunned. So now what I'm gonna do is go home, continue in the event, and it it's weird because there they're not stunned, and the skull is gone. So that is the glitch that I found. Uh, I can't do it now because the round has not ended. And now the round has ended, so I can leave and rejoin. Um, I, it did work with the elite boss, and that is actually how I beat the elite boss. And the elite boss actually has a lot more crazy stuns. So this is kind of just a tutorial on how you can use this glitch to your advantage. Um, I think it's probably going to be better in the late, the late game, because the early game you just get a sniper and you're good. But, it's also pretty useful, like, early, if you get things like the Master Bomber, or other things. I'm just going to remove that. And, I'll see you in a later boss... Uh, or I'll be back for a later boss event, or later boss, later tier boss, so I can show you what more this glitch. Okay, so I got to, this is the final uh, final round of boss, and we're going to use the glitch to, and I've got to continue real quick. Okay, we're going to use the glitch to uh, hopefully beat this tier 5 boss. Okay, and now we need to wait for round 101. Never mind. Okay, so it it's it's a lot better to use in uh, the elite boss, but I couldn't really get that far. I didn't really feel like spending a billion dollars on this, so. Yeah, hopefully you can use the glitch um, to also beat it. Remember, one round has to start, and your towers must be. If if your towers are stunned, and another round starts, then you can leave and rejoin, and your towers should no longer be stunned. Hopefully, this helps you. Um, it helped me beat it. If you want evidence, uh, there. So, uh, try it yourself, see how you can do. 